Here to an ABC News investigation and it's your money, millions in taxpayer dollars. The skyrocketing fraud involving workers' compensation, questionable claims up 24%. Tonight, a contestant on The Price is Right. The problem is she had told work she was injured. This evening, how she's spinning this now to ABC's Cecilia Vega. It's The Price is Right! When you hear those three famous words on The Price is Right, oh, come on now! You do what the man tells you fast, like this woman, Kathy Cashwell. $1,375. But a fortune and fabulous prizes wasn't the only thing Cashwell was collecting. Cashwell was also cashing in three grand a month in workers' comp, claiming an on-the-job shoulder injury left her totally unable to stand, run, reach, or grasp. Here we go, good luck. But there she is, spinning that big, heavy wheel. Not once, but twice. It turns out the Price is Right double dealer isn't the only one. Bogus injury claims cost taxpayers hundreds of millions a year. Scores of former New York City cops and firefighters indicted for falsely claiming they had PTSD and anxiety as a result of the September 11th terrorist attacks. Like former cop Vincent Lamontia, he's accused of lying about depression and then collecting almost $150,000 in disability. But while he claimed to be too ill to work, prosecutors say he took exotic trips and bragged online about having a new job. Hey, I'm Cecilia Vega from 2020. We wanted to ask Lamontia about his seemingly remarkable recovery. And the prosecutors are saying that essentially you're a cop who scammed the system. That's not, I'm not a cop. You were a cop at one oh. point. Why don't you give me a quick comment and then we'll get out of I'm your sorry, hair. I'm I really can't. You claim to be so mentally ill uh, that you no, couldn't okay. work and yet you were still working on the side, basically yeah, defrauding oh, I, I, I the system. Get, I can't hear the phone. Oh, that's really something you're going to see much more of Cecilia taking him on tonight on 2020. In the meantime, Cecilia, you're reporting more than 100 indictments in that 9-11 alleged scheme alone. That's right, David. Uh, Vincent Lamontia and all of those other former cops and firefighters from New York have all pleaded not guilty to all of those charges. Well, more to come on that. And in the meantime, what about our Price is Right contestant? Kathy Cashwell, those pictures were something, right? She told us that despite how it looks in that clip, she was, quote, her words here, hurting the whole time, David. Hurting the whole time. All right, Cecilia, thank you.